Hi guys! Let us have a short discussion about Eclipse. What is an eclipse? According to the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, or NASA, an eclipse happens when a planet or a moon gets in the way of the sun's light. There are two kinds of eclipses on Earth, solar eclipses and lunar eclipses. But before we discuss these kinds of eclipses, let us first describe umbra and penumbra. Umbra is the darker inner part of a shadow cast by the Earth or Moon experiencing the total phase of an eclipse. Penumbra is the lighter outer part of the shadow cast by the Earth or the Moon during a partial eclipse. Then, what is the difference between a solar eclipse and a lunar eclipse? A solar eclipse happens when the moon gets in the way of the sun's light and casts its shadow on Earth. That means during the day, the moon moves over the sun and it gets dark. It will only take place at the face of the new moon. There are two types of solar eclipses, partial solar eclipse and total solar eclipse. A partial eclipse, when the moon doesn't completely cover the sun, happens at least twice a year somewhere on Earth. On the other hand, a total solar eclipse happens about every year and a half somewhere on Earth. This occurs when the light of the sun is totally or fully blocked by the moon. Here, the moon casts the darkest part of the Earth's shadow or the umbra. Now, let's talk about the lunar eclipse. A lunar eclipse is a natural phenomenon that can only happen in a full moon phase. During a lunar eclipse, Earth gets in the way of the sun's light hitting the moon. That means that during the night, a full moon fades away as Earth's shadow covers it up. During a partial lunar eclipse, only a part of the moon appears dark while the rest is lighter. But during a total lunar eclipse, the sky appears totally dark. The moon appears to be blood red. That's all for now. I hope you learned something today. Please try the interactive game related to this topic. Click the link in the description. Please like, share, and subscribe to our channel to help us create more educational videos. Thank you so much!